simplify the following as much as possible. What we can go ahead and do is simplify these to their simplest terms. So with tangent, it's sine squared x over cosine squared x, and then cosecant is going to be 1 over sine squared x, and then minus 1. So what's going to happen here is when we distribute this across, the sine squareds cancel off, so we're left with 1 over cosine squared x minus sine, well, this ends up being, again, just tangent squared x. So this is equal to secant squared x, not secant squared, that's cosecant. Oh, it is secant squared. I'm sorry. I'm really sorry. Okay, let's see if this matches up. So secant squared x minus tangent squared x, because if you subtract tangent from the secant here in this equation, right here, we end up with 1. So this just equals 1. And that's it. That's really nice. Okay, I hope this helped you out. I appreciate you watching, and you have yourself a fantastic day.